Greetings in the name of Jesus Christ. Today's thought is from 1st Kings chapter 18 verse 46. 1st Kings chapter 18 verse 46. Then the hand of the Lord came upon Elijah and he girded up his loins and ran ahead of Jehovah to the en entrance of Jezreel. Here the Bible says the hand of the Lord came upon Elijah. Because the hand of the Lord came upon Elijah, Elijah was able to run ahead of King Ahab's chariots. The worldly way, it's very difficult to run ahead of the chariot. But it happened in the life of Elijah. How it happened? Because of the strength of God. How he received the strength? Because of the hand of the Lord. Bible says the hand of the Lord came upon Elijah. Today, the Lord's hand is upon you. It will make a difference in your life. The, because of the strength of God, we can see a difference in the life of Elijah and King Ahab. The strength of God will the strength of God made a difference in Elijah's life. In your life also, the hand of the Lord is there. So it will give you the divine strength. That strength will make a difference in your life. The Lord wants to give you the divine strength. In your workplace, God wants to show a difference in your life. In your ministry, in your business, or in your family, God wants to show a difference in your life. The Lord wants to show that His hand is upon you. The Lord wants to show a special blessings in your life. The Lord wants to give a divine strength. Shall we ask the Lord to keep His hand upon our life? Let's pray. Jesus, we need your hand. Lord, let your hand come upon us also. Give us the divine strength to run ahead of the chariots. Give us the divine strength so that we can show a difference in our life. Lord, we need your blessings. We need your strength, Lord. We need your hand, Lord. Encourage your children. Bless them. Let this day be a day of blessing for your children. Encourage them, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Amen.